If you clicked on this video, you obviously want to be rich. And rich people speak a certain way. And they simply speak with authority. So I'm going to be showing you the benefits and effects that speaking with authority has on you and others. And then I'm going to actually show you how to speak like somebody that is rich. Because speaking with authority will help you in business, sales, and even content creation. So let's get right into how it will have an effect on the people you talk to. All right, effect number one is that talking with authority shows confidence and others will pick up on that and see it. And if I saw somebody that was trying to sell me something and they were not confident in their products or their ability to provide a service, then I'm not gonna be sold at all. I'm not gonna wanna buy that product. You have to have confidence if you wanna sell anything ever. For example, if I'm not confident that I can mow somebody's yard and do a good job, why would they hire me? Effect number two, it gives you confidence on what you're talking about. If you speak with authority, you are displaying confidence and you are always right to you. When you tell yourself that you can do something, you are programming your brain to accept that as the truth. But you have to tell yourself with no hesitation and no doubt. And that is a great way to build confidence by simply repeating it to yourself. It can never hurt to be more confident in your ability to do something. Effect number three is that when people speak with authority, naturally the attention goes on to them. Naturally, most people will shift their attention to somebody that is speaking with authority because they know what they're talking about and they seem confident in their abilities. This can be used to your advantage in business for obvious reasons, and it can be used to attract views on social media. Effect number four is that it convinces the person you are talking to that you're very knowledgeable on the topic. It doesn't matter if you actually have knowledge or not, you are convincing them no matter what. Effect number five is that it convinces whoever you're talking to that you have made a lot of progress and are very successful in the topic on hand. And again, it doesn't matter if you actually have or haven't. That's what they will think. Now that we have discussed the benefits of talking with authority, it is only right that I tell you guys how to actually do this because it doesn't come naturally. Nah, 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 nah. Step number one, and this may seem a little ignorant, but you have to act like you know every single thing about the topic. This shows confidence, experience, and knowledge, no matter if you have those or not. Step number two is to speak with absolutely zero hesitation. If you speak with hesitation, you are literally moving yourself out of the power of authority. Step number three is to speak without using filler words. Filler words make you sound uneducated and are a form of hesitation. You sound dumb when you're over here, um, um, uh. Oh my god, bro. Oh, hell no. So just cut it out. Step number four is to get the most out with the least amount of words. It is powerful to say the least amount of stuff when you speak. Because then your words become more valuable because they're so scarce. Just get your explanation, get your point out, and shut your mouth. Okay, since you have watched this whole video so far, I can tell that you want to become rich. And you need to implement these things that I've been telling you. Or else you won't achieve your goals and you won't become successful. And you won't become rich. But let me give you some words of encouragement before you go. You can do this. I know you can. It's all in your mind. You just need to believe in yourself first and then jump right in and take actionable steps. You will do it. I know you will. But for now, you need to go get on that grind, go do the work that's necessary, and become somebody, man. If you don't become somebody, the only people you're going to disappoint is God, your friends, your family, your future <laughs> wife, your future kids. That's pretty much everybody. God bless you and make sure to subscribe to not miss out on more valuable content like this.